Hello, D303 Educator. I'm Stephanie Korn, Instructional Technology Specialist at East High School. And today we are going to look at how to set up your Canva account so that students can turn in their Canva assignments right into Canva. So here we have our account settings page. You get there by clicking on this icon when you've logged into Canva. Don't forget to log in via S-Link to be upgraded to our district account. Then over here on the left-hand side, you will see groups. This is where you're going to create a group for each of your classes. So here I have one that I created for my class. If you want to create a new group, you just click the button. And all you have to do is type in names. And our district people that are connected in Canva will pop right up for us. And you can go through and add your students to your group. Once your group is created, when you go back to your Canva homepage, find the document that you would like your students to work in. So here I have this Philippines one. If I click on it, and if I go into Edit Original, this one was a template. If you click on just a regular file, it will open right up for you. And then click on the Share button, and then we'll choose Assignment. Now you're going to pick where students should submit work. We are going to pick Canva. We want a new design for each student so they can each create their own. You can put any instructions there. And then we are going to say which group we are assigning this for. So I'll just type my class. And there it is. And I'll click publish. All right, so my assignment is published. What it has done is done two things. It has um, uh, given your students a notification in Canva, and it has also sent them an email saying that this assignment is ready to go. So now to access this assignment in Schoology as a student, see we have this Canva for Education button. If I click that, what it'll do is it'll open up Canva within Schoology. And then notice how my little notification rang for me. If I click that, that will take them right to the assignment that your students can then edit, make changes to, whatever um, description that you have given for them to do on this assignment. Up here, they can rename it. I always suggest putting the name in there. It doesn't hurt to have it in the title. And then when your students are finished with the project and ready to turn it in, they would click share. And there is this option to send to teacher. They're going to select the teacher. And if they have a message to type in, they can do that and then click send. All right, and then you get this message when your um, when their assignment has been submitted to the teacher. Now, as the teacher, we click the review button. Um, if we have feedback for them, we want them to work on. We can type it in there and give feedback. And then if we go back over to our students, notice it says awaiting feedback here. Okay. If they click there, they can always send a message to you to ask you a question. But if we refresh the button, it should say I have feedback. All right, so check your email. You've got feedback from this design. So um, the feedback is sent directly to the students within their email. They can make changes to this assignment. And then when they're ready to return it back to you, they go back into 
send a teacher. So we can do this process as many times as needed until it is ready to go. All right, and if I go back and I click review again, if I like it, it's great, it's awesome, I can return it. And then as a student, I know that it has been reviewed. And either I refresh the browser and it tells you the design was reviewed, or if they come back home, they will get that notification then that tells them the feedback that I gave them and the design that I gave, that I approved for them. So we can't put grades into Canva, but what you can do then is go back into Schoology, put the grade in for that assignment for the students. All right, so that is how you submit work via Canva, giving feedback, that back and forth. Please let us know if you need anything else along the way.